In this video, the MAC7219 dot matrix module interfaced with Arduino is used as a frequency counter displaying the frequency of a periodic signal. A diagram of the frequency counter is shown here. We have the MAC7219 dot matrix module connected with the Arduino using SPI interfacing. We have a toggle switch connected to digital pin D2. The switch will determine whether we are displaying the frequency on the display in Hertz or in kilohertz. We also have a TTL signal source which is fed into pin D5 of the Arduino. A quick look at the C++ code used in the project. These are the libraries included in the sketch. This library is for the frequency counter. Within the setup function we initialize the dot matrix module and we initialize the frequency counter. Now the parameter 1000 means that uh, the frequency counter within a period of one second will take samples to calculate the frequency. And here we are using this function to display a scrolling text. Within the loop function, if the toggle switch is on the Hertz position, then this if statement is executed. We display a scrolling text and then within a while loop we continuously display the frequency of Hertz until the toggle switch is flipped to the kilohertz position. If the toggle switch is on the kilohertz position then this if statement will be executed. We display the scrolling text and then within a while loop we continuously display the frequency in kilohertz until the toggle switch is flipped to the Hertz position. And now for a quick demonstration. First we see the intro title frequency counter. The toggle switch is initially in the Hertz position so we see the frequency in Hertz. We toggle the switch to the kilohertz position and we get the frequency in kilohertz. We toggle the switch back to Hertz and we get the frequency in Hertz. One thing to note here is that your input signal must be of TTL format. If you input a periodic signal which is non-TTL then you need to add an interface circuit here that will convert your signal to TTL format. In my next video I'll be using the MAC7219 module as a spectrum analyzer. Thank you for watching.